Welcome to First Take. In First Take, I play games I have never played before and record my reactions and impressions. This segment is not limited by game type or system. We will play old games, new games, bad games, awesome games, annoying games, weird games. The best part about First Take is that you, the viewers, will be making the decisions on which games I play. So you will have a major part in this aspect of the channel. So get your popcorn ready and experience First Take. All right, so I haven't played the Crypt yet. I haven't gone in it. I haven't unlocked anything. I have coins from just online games and a few towers that I've done. I haven't played the story mode yet. So we're going to go into the Crypt and just see what I can unlock and see what I can gather. I haven't been here, so this is my first experience with it. So let's check it out. Welcome to the crypt. Spend coins. First tombstone in front of me is free. Ooh, more coins. Hey, how about that? Skip fight award? Who knows what that is, I don't know. Total Cons Fatality. Let's, let's see what happens when I click View. Ah, uh, look, it has a list of all the fighters, so you have to unlock all of their brutalities and fatalities. That's pretty cool. You can see all the stuff that you have. When you move, it kind of... Um, it moves you to a certain point. It's not like free control, it's like spaces on a map. Kind of like uh, if you played Zelda 2, like the grid, how like each square block you can move Link in the overhead world, it's similar to that. If you ever played that game. Uh, secret items appear only at certain times. Okay. Oh, man. It's only visible for a short period of time and we unlocked it and it's an easy fatality award. Because I have so much trouble doing fatalities. Some concept art. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, more concept art. Some ermac it looks like. Oh wow. Ah, uh, that's pretty cool. I guess these are sketches. I like the one uh, with all the hands in the bottom with the hood on. That's pretty cool looking. Floating. I guess these are like the this is like uh, evolution of choices as far as you know the way that they thought about the characters and I guess that's why it's called concept art different concepts I guess that you're developing you test them out you look at them I'm just waiting for something to jump out at me <laughs> 7,000 gotta be something good I would guess Kenshi's brutality what's this Shinnok brutality Boot camp Jackie Briggs. I guess that's a, a skin, I guess. Another outfit, I guess. I don't know what that is. Raiden's brutality. Looks like most of these are brutalities and fatalities. A cutie icon with a K. That's different. It's a little soft for my liking, but, you know, we'll make do. Let's see what else is in here. Let's do this. Tilting world fight fight modifier. Is that? Brutality. 
You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to not unlock these things that are so close right now. I'm going to go, like, deep into the crypt. And I'm going to go mega deep. Super deep. <laughs> Got some music. Let's examine. The gate's locked from the other side. What is this, Resident Evil? Is that what this is? Doors locked from the other side. It's, like, constantly in that game. Souls of Dead Warriors are blocking passage to the tombs. There must be a weapon that can dispel these souls. Oh man. This is like Resident Evil, huh? Alright, we gotta find something here. 590. A little easy fatality action. Tournament Kung Lao. It's another skin, I'm guessing. Quick uppercut recovery fight modifier. So I guess those are all in like the test your luck uh, game. You can change them. Reptiles fatality. The acid bath. Oh, what's this? Snake on that? Ooh, we got some music. Uh, look at this chest. Ooh, 2,000 coins. If I stand on that, will it fall? No. I have a feeling there's like some tricks, some tricks in here that I'll eventually find. I'm going to go through the entire crypt and I'm going to dismantle the whole thing. I'm going to go through it and collect everything in here over the next couple weeks. After I do story mode, I should have a boatload of coins, I'm guessing. The boot to the head? What's that noise? Shinox Brutality. Double damage fight modifier. Let's go deeper. Are we going back? I think we're going back. I don't know. I'm lost. I'm already lost. Oh, it's ahead. Oh, grab the spear. Ooh, I got scorpion spear. Maybe that will dismantle the souls. You never know until you try. Little Kung Jin action. He's the best character in the game, by the way. Tournament Kano. I want that skin. Old school Kano. Uh, let's check out this concept art for Sub-Zero. I like that sword one. Got the sword and looking all swole. We just did like 50 deadlifts with like 600 pounds. That's pretty cool too. No mask. That reminds me of uh, Ultimate Mortal Kombat. That's what that reminds me of. That's pretty cool. Like that. That was a good find. What we got? What we got? What we got? Tournament Raiden. I guess these tournament ones are like old school. Like uh, the tournament in Mortal Kombat 1. Ooh, a Katana Cutie Icon. Hey now. Some wrestling. Okay. Alright. Wrestling action. What's out here? What did I just hear? Let's open this snake up. I like the snakes. Cassie Cage selfie. Fatality. More fatalities. Fatality, fatality, brutality. So many alities, I don't know what to do. Oh, fan concept art. Let's see this. Oh, that is boss. I wonder if they give credit to, like, who makes these. Oh, look at that. That's really cool, too. Little 8-bit action. Nice. This looks like Ultimate Mortal Kombat. With Smoke in the middle. Smoke was the best in that game. He was my favorite. 
I would always use the robot smoke when I would play in the arcade and I would play against the computer and just annihilate the computer like 10 times in a row. And then I would change to human smoke once I got to Montaro because it was easier to beat Montaro with human smoke. So I would use both of those two in conjunction. And um, once you beat the game, I, if you went over, there were, if you remember, there were icons like across. If you went to like the fourth icon in i believe it was you had to fight like some endurance round or something and when you win the endurance round you get to play the game over again i remember going through it i did it i think two or three times in a row i can't remember it was my record i think it was three and i died on my fourth but i'm not 100 percent sure but i'm pretty sure that's what it was i used to play the heck out of that game man Ah, uh, that's a cool one. Cartoon looking. Nice. Yeah, that's pretty cool, man. I like all this stuff. This is this is really cool stuff. They have really done a great job as far as um, appealing to like long-term fans. I think that uh, NeverRealm has done an absolutely fantastic job with that. Let's take a look at this. Ah, oh, that's pretty cool how they show the, like, bare bones version. And they add things. Okay. That's cool. Oh, I don't have enough. I only got 3,000 coins now. Looks like we ripped through most of them. Nope. Don't got enough for that. Oh, here we go. Last one. This will be the last one. Oh, some music. All right, so that's it. Uh, we didn't unlock a whole lot. We didn't. I know that there's much more to unlock here. So we're going to have to do some more towers. We're going to have to do story mode. I would like to get Shinnok. I'd like to lab with him. I think he's a good character as far as what I've played against other people. A lot of people have used him against me. And I like some of the things that he brings to the table. So I really need to get through that story mode so I can play with him. I've just been worried about getting better. And I've been playing online, and I've been practicing. So I've been kind of slacking on the coin collecting, if you will. I've um, been more focused on doing well at, you know, tournaments and things like that. And Sunday is another tournament. Uh, tonight is actually the uh, Final 16, so I'll be watching that, checking that out. And, you know, seeing what I can learn, seeing what I can take from it. So that's it. Thanks for checking in. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you can see... Some more videos of Mortal Kombat, as well as me going through this crypt and ripping it apart, getting everything out of it. So thanks for checking in. It's Big J Glee signing out, and continue to game strong.